this is a poem about uh, how we perceive ourselves in middle age or later years and it's called hand luggage I try to picture this and capture that but see and retrieve absolutely zilch nothing not a scrap the canvas is bare there's nothing new there perhaps a shadow or a tea stained watermark why should the mind continue to recall things left far behind faces names places that have changed or are gone forever nothing new appears in the front room a plastic covered sofa remains in pride of place too good to use and too naff to appraise you should move on they exclaim those who are smug and so very very clever a game which is easier played than won being fast and thrusting is all very well but why rush to be last question do you have a deep rooted abhorrence of change no we all change begrudgingly and in imperceptible ways at least imperceptible to ourselves it's like this we you and I occupy comfortable if wary lives bound by the safe confines of what we know of course we smile at the right times and are pleasant to one another it's no big deal we know what's real and like to get by when the need arises we don't feel unduly put out about our less than honest approach why should we as we age our minds become inflexible though stronger we no longer feel the need to please anyone other than ourselves but I'm not enamoured by what we see in a maze of mirrors they tend to phase when we stare the young person is no longer there an old fool stares back but take comfort the image is just a physical view it's not really you you're stored somewhere in a back room along with rampant piety newly acquired and other insurance policies compressed and ready to admire when the time inevitably emerges <laughs>